What up, Kung Fu fam? It's Wes, and I said if you were good, that I would bring back the lovely Rachel Reynolds. And you were good, so look who's back. After this, you're gonna see more of her, and you're gonna learn some stuff. But first, watch this. Legend would have it that Zhao Kuang Yin was the creator of the three section staff long before he was the first emperor of the Song dynasty. Wonder what song it was. <laughs> so his staff broke in a battle. And let me guess, someone put it back together for him? Yes, his blacksmith. Then what, did it break again? Yes, and he fixed it again with chain. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> with chain? With a chain. With chain. With a chain. With chain! <laughs> oh. With chain. Hey, with chain! Thus becoming the three-sectional staff. <clears throat> Some people just can't throw things away. The first recycling emperor of China, Zhao Guangyin. I don't know. Some people believe it to be the precursor to the Nunchaku. <laughs> <laughs> the three sectional staff is a really cool weapon because it has the ability to be a long, medium, and a short ranged weapon. You know, because of all the different sections. <laughs> Another cool thing about the three sectional staff is that it's like wielding two weapons. Yeah, because you have to coordinate two different things simultaneously. One will be spinning one way and another thing will be spinning another way. So, lots of coordination within these palms. <laughs> so awkward. The three section staff is the bludgeoning weapon. So, if you want to practice it and you're not really familiar with weapons, I would say wear a helmet. More of us swinging a three sectional staff right after this palm strike. Yeah! Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. If you liked what you saw, give us a thumbs up. Uh, maybe sh subscribe <laughs> if you're not already subscribed. Uh, share it with someone that you think would enjoy it. That'd be awesome too. Check out my social media. Check out Rachel's social media. In all of which will be in the links below. Yes, and a small shout out to my master in Italy, Mario Mandra. Thank you for teaching me three sections. Oh, and also Hyper Martial Arts. Thank you so much for hooking up my martial arts team, the Kung Fu Heroes, with this gear. We're going to put links to their stuff down below as well. 
Thank you guys so much, and until next time, stay awesome. Woo hey everybody. So, this is where I would normally tease next week's weapon, but uh, I don't wanna... But I will tell you this, that it is probably another flexible weapon. Which weapon do you think it'll be? Surprise, 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 surprise? <laughs>